Hey, what's up, YouTube? Rookie Trader here. Hopefully, everybody's having a good day today out there. We are looking at the old Crypto Casino, uh, aka Dex Tools, right? And we're going to take a look at some of the charts that we have been looking at over the past week or so. And uh, we found a new meme coin yesterday, all right? So, we're going to go ahead and take a look. Let me not make you guys wait any longer here. Okay, I always close my chart, I leave my charts open and that comes up. Okay, so this is going to be Link USDT side of life. It looks like here people have been accumulating, okay, as of kind of looks like it's been accumulating from Wednesday, June 1st of 22, all the way through September, okay, of 23. That's kind of just been going sideways, a little upsies, downsies. If we lift it up, it's been uptrends, downtrends, little small gains here and there. But we've lately been on a nice little uppity up, up. This is a monthly chart, which I just forgot. Let me jump off of that really quick here. Okay, let me jump down to the, oh, okay. So let's reload this chart because it's tripping on me right now. All right, so let's go down to that full hour chart. Like I said, from the look like what it was like 2021 or something like that to about 2023. Nice little accumulation period. But for the last few days, well, let's say we had a really nice that's that that there it goes again. There it goes. There's that nice little downtrend from Monday night, Tuesday uh, into kind of this morning dropped all the way down to about 1389. OK, I wish I could have caught that. But uh, we're on a nice slow uptrend now. We're kind of on a downtrend now. It's kind of in the red a little bit. But I mean, those levels look nice, though. It's, it's looking pretty good. I don't know what that is right here. Let's see if we can get all these old secondary weak drawings off. OK, my draw game is weak. I just need to uh, step that up a little bit. OK, so it's the four hour mark. And I'm going to shoot back to that monthy, the monthy. <laughs> the month so this is kind of showing where we're at on the month chart we are on a we are on an uptick we are on an uptick is it gonna have an uptick like we did over here at the 44 dollar mark for chain link or over here on the 53 dollar mark you know never know just got to keep our eyes on the chart whether we're gonna get in here i don't know um you know, you, you could. Right now, it's kind of risky. It doesn't really... Let's see. Where were we at? This is going to be... This is 2019. So, let's just put that there just to kind of gauge a... So, it, it's not really looking too far from that bottom, does it? Right now, yeah, um, just gotta keep our eyes on it. Right now, would I accumulate right now? I probably would start accumulating link right now, to be honest. I probably would, because I'd be afraid that this was gonna happen, okay? But, uh, you know, this is a good level, 13, 14 dollar mark. Uh, wish it would come back down to a damn five, eight dollar mark, whatever, but it's not, okay? So, we just gotta keep our eyes on it. Okay, this is going to be uh, Solana U U USDT. Um, this is going to be the 15 minute chart. We're just going to make this just a little bit faster here because I just shot the video a second ago and I shot it was like 45 minutes. It's like, why wow, you're running your mouth, buddy? <laughs> we got to shorten that. Ain't nobody going to watch a funky tail for almost an hour. All right. All right. Okay, so anyways this is a uh, solana same thing nice it's been accumulating accumulating all the way up until what's this uh wednesday like june of 22 okay so this is uh september of 23 and it's just been going up okay so it is on an uptrend now whether it is going to jump back to these levels of the 258 mark we're hoping so so uh, we just really have to keep our eyes on it. Like I said, this is the one month chart. We can shoot down to the four hour chart, which I love so much. And let's, I wonder, is there a way to really, hold on, let me do this, remove all that. Let's grab that. And let's see here. 
sometimes I don't know if you guys have issues dragging your charts around I'm a rookie trader y'all so I'm trying to figure it out but for now looks like we're on a nice little uptrend here like I said I have a buddy who trades and this guy he does you don't worry about the the all the the little you know the little the little spicy technical analysis and all the news and all that crap he just identifies patterns on the chart and trades off those patterns i just like okay that's pretty good you're gonna get fucking wrecked boy but uh didn't happen you know he's over there winning i'm like wow okay let me learn some of that kind of risky for my taste you know what i mean but uh i love these charts i love it i love it i love it it kind of gauges you in the direction uh which way uh the trade's going so whether i would get into solana right now i don't know it's way up there but i you know everybody we have good high hopes for solana i don't think it's gonna drop you know but you know what we don't think doesn't matter never really know it's crypto but I don't see it dropping at least all the way down here. It might come down a bit. Um, hopefully it came down here, you know. Come down to that $40 mark, please. Okay? We'll keep our eyes on the chart, you guys. Just talk crap a little bit. Right? This is going to be Jam USDT. On, I play with Jam on Binance. Okay, this is going to be the monthly chart. I've been accumulating Jam for, for a while for a while for a while for a while let's jump down to the four hour chart like i said this is pretty much where we are at right now okay bring that over here this should be monday yep okay we had our nice run up got all the way down up to uh got all the way up to 0 0.002 cents that is that, that's up there, you know what I mean? Jam had a pretty nice run. Bags look fully packed. And then there was a nice little drop off. I like that. Packed a little bit of bags right here. Just kind of trading a little bit sideways now. Whether it's gonna go down, I always think everything's going down. So right now we're kind of in the red. So we're kind of going down a little bit now. But uh, you know, I'm just hoping that it goes down. I hope that things go down so we can get more, you know what I mean? More accumulation, right? But, uh, you know, we just got to keep the, watching the charts to kind of see where that is going. Okay, this is going to be SATs. Like I said, when I uh, I located SATs, which is going to be a BRC20 token, I was actually watching this video. These two guys were talking about ordinals and BRC20 tokens and all this stuff like that. So I'm like, okay, like, what the hell? Like, you know, whatever. Okay, so anyways, um, this one guy... He was talking about sats, you know, so I went and I looked it up on KuCoin and I, I was like, oh, it's there. You know what I mean? There's a whole nother, like, like a whole nother world, you know, BRC20 tokens. Never knew anything about that. There is a complete different uh, BRC20 wallet. Um, like it's all different. You know, I didn't know that. But um, anyways, sats, uh, it, it's been, it, it, it had a very good run. I mean, sats went up. My bags is super packed. Okay, then it had a nice uh, downtrend. They dropped it. Okay, dropped it really nice. Bears came in the house and dropped it. They brought it back up, dropped it again, brought it back up. So that's kind of the trend that it did kind of all day yesterday. Then it kind of dropped all the way down to about two, four, six zeros. 4436, excuse me. And then it's been kind of trading, you know, up and down, kind of straight across since. Okay, we're on a small downtrend right now, kind of in the red now. I packed another little bag so uh, we're gonna see where sats is gonna go i didn't expect it like i said i just got it picked it up we're in the green baby we love it okay milady meme coin now milady meme coin when i got milady meme coin milady meme coin was down here okay this is around later november hey a little bit mid later november okay and it just went on a rise the other day i mean milady meme coin hasn't really did too much you know since it's been out you know it's on uh, crypto.com you know and that's kind of where i got it um things like that but uh yeah it, it's just you know it came all the way up here to what i think that's like the six zero mark eleven three nine nine and then it pulled back yesterday and then now it's kind of like a nice little uh green tick up and now we have dropping back down just a little bit so how far it's going to go down, I don't know. Once again, I would love it if it did something like that. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, 
somewhere around here that way we can get some more you know make the bags bigger when it goes up the gains get larger you know what i mean but we will keep our eyes on that this is avax usd avax we are on the four hour chart seems like we're on an uptrend uptrend right now a little bit of a pullback but avax has big potential we just have to keep our eyes on these charts watch your charts every day you guys watch your charts that's what i've learned watch your charts you watch your charts charts kind of give you a good idea of kind of what's going on and you know slap your moving averages and all that stuff on there so you can kind of see so the moving average there look at that it's kind of it was going straight up earlier now it's then kind of curved down a little bit sell orders then came in and that looks like it might be heading towards a little bit trying to do something like this maybe up a little bit more but i bet it's not gonna go any farther than here it's gonna come back down it's not time yet you know what i mean it's not time yet that's it for avax it will be time very very soon okay we're gonna go ahead and let's go restart that i gotta to refresh that chart i said i leave my charts open and sometimes they just don't come back but this is gonna be in the four hour chart or d like i said again that same story i told you about watching youtube with the two guys where i found sats i also found ordies off that same channel now then like i said when i found that out um i think it was um somewhere it was like it was around here because it was the later part of november and it was at yep on the 20 dollar chart 20 dollar mark somewhere around there they were saying that it's around the 20 something dollar mark you better get in now people don't know about already and ordinals and la 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 and they're gonna sleep on it and what happened they got in the ordinals got all the way up to 70 damn dollars that means that i don't know how much you copped okay around here if you even copped around here if you man let me let me bring that out some if you got lucky if you got lucky and you caught in here it was at two dollars and ninety two cents everybody's like ordinals what's an ordinal get the fuck out of here ordinal i don't care about no ordinals what happened you wish you did just imagine if you got in down here at 275 and it went all the way up to 70 freaking dollars and right now we're still sitting at like $51 so you're in some major massive profit so like I said I drove my I, I drew my chart here this is a wish wish upon a star I was hoping it would go down as we can see it went the opposite direction it started to go back up a little bit so hopefully it can drop down here like this maybe uh, entertain a couple of people like this maybe hopefully you get some bad news somewhere you know some FUD let it drop here that way we can get in and then it's gonna shoot through the stars <laughs> that's a dream okay that's a dream this is gonna be Pepe I'm gonna go ahead and X off Pepe but uh Pepe right now is in the red but uh, Pepe had a nice little run right here. This is uh, November of 23. It was that Monday here. We had a nice run actually from here up to about the 246 mark, 14081. And then we had a nice down tick. This is the sellers of bulls or bears came in house and just dropped it okay and then we traded sideways ever since is it a good time to get in not really too sure you know i mean this oh this, oh sorry this is a 15 minute chart that's why i'm, I'm just like wow rookie trader y'all you know remember that okay okay so this is this is how we're doing sometimes like i said my charts they don't reload correctly i should just reload them as soon as i click on them but now this now now we got action here all right so we're on the four hour chart here this is i mean pepe 2.0 has been through the ringer i've been part of pepe 2.0 like let me see october no it was somewhere back here it's been way before 20 it's been way back here when it wasn't really doing too much but um yeah here it is 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 I got in Pepe way, I'm talking way, 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 way when it started, you know, like around here, you know, I've been messing around on Pink Cell and all that stuff, but anyways, I found Pepe 2.0 somewhere around here, I was able to catch this initial, pulled out my profit, and everything else has been going down ever since, so, you know, like I said, we're on a very small uptrend here, it, if it's, it had a nice run up here, I completely missed that. But that's what happens when you're trying to you know mess with too many tokens at one time you know you're not gonna catch everything 
small uptake here whether it's going to go back to these levels or not like it was on the other side not really too sure okay we'll have to keep our eyes on it this right here is going to be santa grok like i told you guys i copped a very small position somewhere around here you know i pulled my initial off somewhere around here something like that but it's been on a downtrend ever since you know kind of a let's see if we can So kind of here, you know, resistance, resistance, resistance. Then it started going, you know, downtrend, downtrend, downtrend. It's almost pretty much to flush levels with where it first started. You know what I mean? At the bottom, pretty much. So is it a good time to grab Santa Grock? Yes. How was the popularity like and all that? I don't know. You guys go ahead and check it out. You know, you can kind of see what's going on. Kind of check the buy and sell orders you know and uh kind of see what's going on with it they renounced the contract that's pretty good that wasn't like that before so but the buy and sell tax is still 10 percent i see a lot of fud in the comments talking about santa grok scam and all that other stuff it's down 68 percent in the last 24 you know um you know getting in right here it, it could be you know it's a it, it could be a blessing and a curse you know what i mean because you could get in here and get lucky and like we said like i have these old trashy drawings here but it could shoot to the stars from here you know what i mean and you'll be happy okay but then again who knows it looks like in the bottom right now yeah bye 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 okay but who knows it could shoot through the floor as well and shoot way down here to 16 zeros 13 14 zeros you never know you know what i mean these meme coins i've seen it done i have seen it done these meme coins and different coins you just get in they're not legit tokens and they just go you know uh, but then you could also sleep on this and say no it ain't gonna do nothing you're gonna roll off you check your chart tomorrow and it's way back up here or it's then came up here so you could have some really good gains take a look do your research hop in if you like that's santa grok on the bnb side okay this is Baby Bunk Inu. I found this yesterday. Thought that this was really interesting here. Um, I actually liked it on the BNB side of life. You know, Bunk is on like what Solana and Ethereum and all that stuff. So this is pretty much where the chart's sitting at. Okay. So, um, so if you mark it here, we'll just. I know the line's not straight. Kind of straighten it out. They're the ones who are laughing at my line. Okay. So anyways we're about here now okay it seems like we are on a slow uptrend but that's not always the case because right here is where i got in yesterday okay uh no was it yesterday yeah it was here i think um i think i i was gonna get in here no that's right that's right because this is baby bunk okay i was gonna get in here yesterday so i'm watching wait hold on yep okay we're on the 15th all right so yesterday we were gonna get in here okay i didn't really know because i seen that this red look how it's going down boom boom it's going down at that point in time when i looked at the chart this my moving average is pointing down so i know your moving average is not a tell-all you know but it does kind of give you kind of a idea about what's going on in the chart where is it where it's going you know but it will say you know this is kind of where I think it's going, but at the same time, I don't really know. Don't take my word. It's not golden, but it could be, okay? Well, I thought it was gonna go down, so I was gonna wait, and I was hoping that it got down here, okay? Or at least somewhere around here. Nope, went the other way. Boom, went the other way. Next thing you know, missed all this. Went, came back down, went all the way up. Really nice. It almost got back up to its high. Came up here, looking really nice, nice and pretty down tick okay it ticked all the way down now this is where we are now see look now we're in the red right now so that's a good thing that's a cool thing i'm hoping that this goes down you know hoping because if it goes down we can hack. <laughs> hack okay so i found this like i said it's only a few days old you guys can kind of do your research on this baby bunk inu let's go ahead and drop down here a little bit 84 out of 99 on the deck score contract is renounced buy and sell taxes five percent 54.5 in a community trust no token description yet 
lots of buy and sell orders you guys can kind of check this out on your own when you guys get a chance you gotta do your research way more than this check out their x page all that website all that good stuff you see a lot of buy orders in this is scary when you see so many buy orders in okay pretty much you're like late to the party you know what i mean i mean you're not all the way late to the party i've came in this late to the party before but you know just know that you just just imagine you it goes down to about here again okay to the 82084 mark right just imagine if it goes here and then you say okay cool it's a good time to buy you buy in right next thing you know all oh, these guys that are that bought that are waiting that are in green they all start selling them ah, now you drop all the way down here but um yeah crypto is a stanky game you know um that we just dump on each other it's player versus player you know but anyways i don't know if this is a good mark to buy in but knowing me i have hundreds of meme coins already from all past bad ex bad experiences and they're not all bad experiences okay so what i'm gonna do is i'll probably cop another bag here and then kind of see where it goes and we'll just keep it on the screen and we're gonna check on it here's our website um baby bunk inscriptions you can kind of check this out babybunkbsc.com uh, it's the ecosystem of baby bunk you know emoji pack meme coins nft designs web free applications they have a lot of different things on here um, their tokenomics is going to be somewhere on here, but you guys can kind of here it is a transaction fee, a transaction fee, baby bump five percent, including one percent for reflections and four percent for buyback and burn investment value, blah blah. Token info, total token supply of baby bump is going to be we'll go one, two, three, we'll go million, billion, trillion, so two, we're going to be two quadrillion. So, you guys can check this out on your own time when you guys get a chance. Like the video if you guys like the video. Uh, hit the subscribe button so it lets you guys know when I drop. Plus, you guys can help out the channel just a little bit. You guys have a good day, alright? Rookie Trader. Yeah.